What's up guys, welcome to Rafa's Garage. Today we're gonna work on GT4 right here, back here. Um, somebody asked for a quote for the GT4 hood and the bumper. So we're gonna take it off right now. Um, if you haven't already done so, please like, subscribe, and let's get started. Bumper, all you need is a couple of screws, one, two, three, four, four 10 millimeters, and then you have probably like another two right here inside the fender. You have to go through here. There. One, two, I'm not sure if it has three. And then just unplug the turning signals right here. And that's about it for the bumper. Uh, the hood, pretty easy. Only two here, two there. They're probably 12 or 14. And that's it. Should come off. right there and then just the top ones it makes it easier if you turn the wheel um now we have access to it through the fender um and that's it this is the old gt4 bumper it's pretty much ready to paint there it is the hood is off Pretty easy, four bolts. Bumper's there, hood is over there. Now let's see if it fits in the Celica. If not, I'm gonna take off with the truck and get a estimate on this guy. When shipping big parts like this, um, Greyhound. Greyhound's the way to go. Uh, they won't ship to the door, but they'll ship to the nearest location, which mine is like down the block, like two minutes. It is, put everything in there perfect fitment right there so let's see i didn't even try to put it in the silica because i didn't want to take out the c1 bar so let's head out see how much it is ship these parts i already went to greyhound both these parts together it's like 120 or 140 to ship um gave me an estimate for 120 but it's gonna go up once i wrap it make a box and start adding more weight and more dimensions on it so i'd say like 140. <laughs> 